Hi everybody, how you doing? I'm doing pretty good. I was gonna do another Dutch board today, but I figured I told some of you I'd show you them dry, the ones I've been doing. Um, this one can, I looking at it can be just about turned, you know, like you could have it any way you really want on this one. I think this way too looks pretty neat. So, huh. but I love this one. It is not glossed yet, but it turned out very nice. Uh, Dawn had mentioned it reminds her of like, like a Spanish painting. I believe that I agree with that. I think it's pretty neat. Anyway, so there's that one. Okay, and this one here, I just loved. I thought it was very cool. <laughs> I was pretty happy with this. So you could either have that one this way too. Oh, yeah, can have it that way. Turned out pretty. It dried pretty good too. Yeah. Uh, let's see it upside down. Just out of curiosity. That's neat too. Oh, I have it that way. Okay. Or you could. Mm, no. <laughs> this one I was really loving. I was really, really liking this one. There, it's not glossed yet either. Turned out really awesome. Split color ones. I love it. Really neat. Yeah, big, big ones too. 16, oh, 12 by 16s, yeah. Okay, so I'm thinking today, oh, I was going to do the 16 by 20, but I changed my mind. I'm going to use a 10 by 20. And the colors I'm using is black. I'm going to use gold, copper, and bronze, and white. Okay. So I have a, I'm using the bronze Liquitex Basics, which I kind of wish I had an artist loft, but I don't. Because I always notice that this bronze I don't know if you guys ever have either, but it has a tint like of a sort of like a rose gold tint to it, or you know, sort of like it, like it has a little purple in it or something. But that's the way it is. But I'm gonna go ahead and do it anyway with my copper because it's very close to the copper look. Anyway, <laughs> let's go for it. So I'm going to cover my canvas with black. Piece of glitter. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what this does. Oh, 
drum. Okay, so I'm liking that. I am liking that. You know, I like, I'm always like the most biggest chicken because if I like something and I stop and don't keep going, in which I should, but you know, I like this kind of down here. And there's so much paint always on it, so it always ends up, uh, spreading anyway so i know this is gonna end up going off the edge which is a bummer because that sure is pretty i could keep it from doing that like going like this as a matter of fact i think i'm gonna but <laughs> I don't want that going off the edge. But I think it's going to. <laughs> That's so pretty. That's beautiful. Yeah, we'll see what the stick does. You know, I don't want it running too much. There we go. That is so cool. These are getting funner and funner. You know what? I'm not even going to torch it. I don't even want it to speck up or anything, so I'm leaving it alone. The only place I'm going to torch is where the black is. So I'm going to let that set for a while. We'll see if it keeps kind of going down a little bit, but it's super awesome. I love it the way it is. Really do not want that going over the edge. <laughs> I'm going to prevent that from going over the edge. I am determined. <laughs> okay, there's only one thing I want to do here. I just want to blow this out just a little bit. If I can. I can't reach it. Pajamas full of paint again. I love this like a hundred times better than my other ones. I don't like my other ones, but I'm learning slowly but surely. The one thing I did do different with this one is I I put my blower on low and I made my paint much thinner. And I just went for it. <laughs> so that's pretty. So we'll hold it up here. Really neat. I love that white in there. So that went well, that bronze. That's really neat, that. <laughs> thrilled with it. It's got a pretty shimmer too. I 
I like how that is right there. That's neat. So I can say I'm learning a little bit. Well, let me know what y'all think of this one. I love this one <laughs> above all the rest. And I hate saying that sometimes about my paintings because then I feel sorry for the other ones. <laughs> That's kind of funny, but I do. But this is awesome. So I appreciate everybody watching and um, commenting, all the new subscribers, hello. It's, it's very nice of you to be here. And uh, I don't always do this, but I do it every once in a while. Just mention if you'd like to help support my channel uh, to get some supplies for my projects, um, that would be awesome. My link is in my description. I appreciate the donations I got last month. So that really helped out a lot. Uh, thank you very much, everybody. So have yourself a wonderful day or evening, and I will catch you later. Bye-bye now.